Ranjan Matagalli, the ICC match referee, passes on the coin. Heads is the call. It's a good toss for Michael Clark too. It's a tail. So Australia have won the toss. Michael Clark, what are you going to do first? Uh, we're going to have a bat, Flem. Thank you. Nice. Good move into the ball from David Warner. Oh, great stroke. No apparent sign of nerves. That's out. That's out, I'm afraid. And it's David Warner. Uh, Umesh Yadav has his man, and what a man it is. What a moment. And that's good balling from India. There's pressure from Mohamed Shami at the other end. And Umesh Yadav strikes. Been a golden summer for Steve Smith. Played magnificently in the Test Series against India. And swing it straight away. Five men are behind square on the offside as Smith sprints back for a couple. What a stroke. What a stroke. Stand still and watch the ball under the blade of the... That's a beauty. That's what Saurabh Ganguly wants to see from Aaron Finch or doesn't want to see depending on your take. <laughs> it's in the air to hit the gap and that's uh, the shorter side. We'll get there for four. And that's four more. Oh, another one. Great shot. Another pull shot from Smith. Three mid wicket for four. Well, if it's bad, if it's going to work, it's going to work quickly because the short ball is uh, vanishing to the boundary very, very quickly. Great punch there from Finch. That's the power. That's a good shot. It's short and wide from Mohit Sharma. There's nobody there. Thanks to Damien Fleming. Four runs. Brilliant. Fantastic batting. There's 50 for Aaron Finch. Backing up what Steve Smith has achieved before him. It's come in 82 balls. Hit just five boundaries. Brilliant. Little skip. Straight down the ground as always. This looks like it's going to be a good innings. Four ball. There's nobody there. And it doesn't matter even if there was somebody. That'll be 100 for Steve Smith. Not for the first time and something tells me not for the last. It's been an absolutely brilliant innings. He's just whipped into the long fall of David Warner's wicket with an uncertain finch and taken control. 100 from 89 balls, it's one. And we'll keep coming. Aaron Finch has got room, he's got width, and he's got inspiration from the other end. All right then, you can have as many as you want. But he'll end up playing shots like that, Aaron Finch. Shot down the ground. Slow ball. Well picked up from Smith and Hemmed past long run. Well, the feel of that. This could be the wicket India wanted. And it is. It's a huge wicket for India. Question is how late has it come, but it's come nonetheless, and Stephen Smith's gone for 105 from 93. That's gone fine. Could go over wide too, actually. They strike to him on the swing. Strong. Change of bowling's work. Good catch. You see, good bowling. And good field setting, Maxwell goes. Good field from Dhoni, he had the reverse option out of the target, out on the fence, and he managed to get the very dangerous Maxwell. That's a huge wicket for India. He's got him, he has yeah. got him, thinks he's going to go. That's what India needed, to go bang, bang. Got a couple of wickets, first they removed Maxwell, and now Finch on 81. Starts with it, and gone! It is the short ball, it's worked again, it's been spliced to mid-wicket. The Australian captain's gone. Well, Nassi caught it beautifully. Short ball that they'll try and certainly works. So Michael Clark just got that high on the bat, didn't quite get it. And unfortunately for him, he depart. Big shot comes. Last ball from Ashwin. 
has disappeared for six. This is that six again. It was flat. Oh, he's bowled him. Full straightforwardness swings across the line. And all of India celebrate. Or he can bowl straight and do that. And he's done it extremely well. Certainly got the good pace. Oh, he's waited for that one, but he's going to find the field, he does. The slow ball has deceived Shane Watson. India continue to take wickets. It's big boundaries. That's the advantage of playing on big grounds. There have been six on a lot of other grounds. Yes. He does. He gets all of it. And we've got some momentum going. No ball cramped him for space, he'll get a single. Australia will finish on 328 for seven. In the gap and four. That's up in the air, but that's miles back. Oh, look how quickly that's travelled. Now he's gone the distance here. Oh, come on, that big scoring order. Down the ground again, he's enjoying himself here, Shikardana. Oh, another good shot in the air. Maxwell's the man, he's got it. Just what Australia needed. Hazelwood's the man. Michael Clark, the bowling changed. Worked. Hazelwood back into the attack. Went straight to the safe hands of Glenn Maxwell. And the dangerous Shikha Darwin's gone. They needed that, Australia. What a big wicket that is. And we'll come back to that. Do you guys pick up? Yes, Bish, it's in the air. Easy catch to Brad Adden. So the door had a departure. He's bowled into by Mitchell Johnson. The dangerous for that Coley is going back to the dressing rooms. What a massive wicket. Huge wicket there for Australia. Mitchell Johnson, the man with the bat, but now the man with the ball. Oh, it's well struck. That is six all the way. Oh, he's bowled him through the gates. Fantastic bowling from Mitchell Johnson. Well, that's it. What a great way to follow up. He's been pumped for six, held his nerve, pitched it on sort of middle and off. It came back and it's taken middle. As a wicket taker, good stroke. Simple little pick up. Oh, he's got it. Yes, he has. And James Fulton has got it too. Some extra bounce does for Suresh Rayner. A great bowling change, wasn't it? Fulton is on and he gets the wicket away. A loose shot. A sloppy shot, a bit more extra pace and bounce from Faulkner. Well, here he is, Emma Stoney, one of the games. Doney goes bang down the ground, anything full and straight, and Doney whacks it. Oh, that'll go all the way to four, short and wide, and Doney got the helicopter out. Yeah, an excellent shot down the ground. Oh, he's found the gap. And he's found the gap well enough for four. And, and he just finished it off. He finished it off like he always does. Okay. Looks close, but uh, nothing there, Kumar, at this stage on video. Waiting for Snicko. Iran had gone for 44. It's 178 now for five in. Will be a boundary, a welcome boundary. Well, he finally went for it. And it pops out. I think he's done a remarkable job, Michael Clark, just to get there. And the fifth single directed is what's needed. Directed is provided. Stephen Smith with the directed. Is there anything he cannot do on the field? He can hit the ball direct, he can spot a nick nobody has, and he can take catches that nobody else does. Jadeja will have to go out for 16. Another wicket to Australia. And he advances, hits it hard, over cover. Six runs, great strike from MS Dhoni. We've been waiting for that one way to bring up your 50. He's just plotted along MS Dhoni. He goes again, straight down the ground, so consecutive sixes to Dhoni. Brilliant batting. I think he's been waiting for Watson. Simple as that. Ooh, that's out, is it? He's given up. A direct hit again has worked for the Australians. So, Emma Stoney, the Indian captain.
the best thing about this, apart from the fact that it was MS Stone, he was one stump. From that position, you can see he's got one, maybe one and a half stumps to aim at. And dead-eyed Dick Doney had given up. The great man's gone. It's 231 for seven. Oh, it's hit the stumps. Bales are flying. Faulkner picks up his second wicket. Yeah, this is a stage of the innings where Australia are very good. Changes of pace, reverse swing, left armers with the angle. Faulkner charging in. He's hit the stumps again. Pitching middle, hitting off. Biology gold there from Faulkner. Yeah, very good on the angle. Secret of the left armers. Tailenders just don't get it, I'm afraid. The left armor, whether it be Stark from round the wicket or Faulkner from over the wicket. He's hit the stumps. That's a classic dismissal from Mitchell Stark to the opposition tail ender. So he continues his fantastic World Cup. He's got another game in him. Australia are through to the World Cup final on Sunday at the MCG against New Zealand.